And new tonight, a mother is taking on the Internet, fighting tech companies like Google. She says they're profiting off child sex trafficking. NBC4 is Angie Crouch, live right now in Santa Monica, to explain all of this for us. Angie. That's right, Colleen. We spoke with that mother from Washington. She came here to Santa Monica today to join the consumer watchdog group. They're calling for tech companies to be held responsible when children are trafficked for sex online. Their legal battle is being featured in a new documentary film. We'll never be the family we were before she was sold on that website. We need someone to give us a fighting chance. A Washington family is speaking out in a new documentary film called I Am Jane Doe. It's about their ongoing efforts to change federal law to allow families of kids trafficked on the Internet to file civil lawsuits against Internet providers who host the websites or profit from ads. The right for profiteering corporations to be free of the internet should not come at the expense and the pursuit of happiness, safety, and security to our American children. This mother says her daughter was trafficked online. She claims Google profited from ads on that website. These advocates are speaking out against current federal law, which says internet providers are not responsible for the content they host. Internet freedom, First Amendment freedom on the internet, does not include trafficking in children for sex acts. Google says it's doing all it can to prevent online child trafficking, saying, quote, we will continue to use our technology to combat the tragedy of child sex trafficking. We'll continue our significant funding of organizations that combat this crime and maintain our zero tolerance approach to ads for this illegal activity. <clears throat> A congressional subcommittee is currently looking at this issue, but all the previous court rulings have sided with companies. We're live in Santa Monica. Angie Crouch, NBC4 News.